Star Trek. I, I was basically raised on Star Trek. I watched Star Trek as of a very young age. And um, what lured me in was the possibilities, right? I could be up there on that ship as a member, as an important member of that crew, um, you know, seeking out strange new worlds and, and trying to meet new civilizations. And that was, it just opened up everything to me in that sense. It allows us to aspire for more. It allows us to say, hey, this is what we could be if we just try hard enough, or if we, we were better people. And I think that's, that's an amazing thing to be able to, to bring to, to, to an audience and to touch people that way too. I mean, diversity, right? That was a basic thing in Star Trek where Gene Roddenberry went, nope, we're not even gonna tackle that issue. It's done, it's fixed, it's solved. And being able to present a future where things were ideal in that sense, while not being you know, absolutely perfect, there are still issues. See Spock struggling between being Vulcan and being human um, reflects our society today still, but allows us too to say, hey, this is what we could be if we work at it. I think that's the most amazing thing we can do with our media right now, is just opening doors for people, giving them a glimpse of how things could be, not just for, for, for the world, for humanity, but for them personally. Um, people who say, hey, we made our first friends in your video games, or who have found friends because of our video games. And I think that's a, that's a pretty impressive legacy to leave behind, it's connections. Um, I think it all goes back to belonging. I think trying to find our place is not just about finding our place in our society, in, in, on our planet, it's about finding our place in the universe. Um, and sometimes we're more you know, directly impacted by the day-to-day -day stuff and the, the immediate stuff, and then every now and then you just pause and you, you daydream. You want to know that you're part of something bigger. It doesn't get much bigger than the universe right now. With my writing, I'm just hoping I can provide that sense of belonging that I found in stories to other people as well. And if I manage to do that for even one person, to me, that'll be an amazing achievement, right? I managed to give to one person that feeling of belonging, that feeling that everything will be okay, that I got from media and from books and from, from Star Trek when I was a kid. And to me, as a child, that was life-changing, right? That was, so if you can do that for even one person, isn't that the most amazing thing you can do? My name is Anne LeMay and I'm Chasing Atlantis.